welcome to my channel. I know it has been a while and I've actually bought so many wigs in the meantime and I just have not had the time to review them. But when I got this one, I was like, I have to make time to review it. I looked at the stock card and I was just like, this wig is gorgeous and it has so many great features. So let's dive straight into the review. It's a review of the Shani wig by Zuru Hollywood. It is a 13 by 4 HD lace wig with elasticated straps, one, two, three combs. Now the lace is HD lace, but it is not so white. It's light coloured lace, but not the whitest type of lace, but it will still blend into most skin tone. So even if you're fair skinned, you will be able to wear this. The hairline is pre-plucked and they have paid a lot of attention to that fine knotting at the front to give it the most realistic effect, especially can you can see that on the baby hairs. That pre-plucking gives it that graduated hairline, which gives it a more realistic effect. The colour I've got is lovely. It is the FFT Caramel Blonde. And as you can see, it is a beautiful, soft rooted colour and it's sort of an ombre and it is so realistic. Oh, I can't wait to try this on. Let me just test for shedding. That's just brilliant, no strands. Now this hair is actually a human hair blend wig. So when you're feeling the hair, you've got that coolness that comes with the human hair and you've got the dynamic color going on there from the synthetic. And you know that because it's got synthetic in there, it will also just hold those curls. Lovely. Just really nice to the touch. Look, I'm gonna tint the lace, cut the lace off and try it on. Oh mamma mia. This wig screams glamour. Can you see how that lace, I haven't even finished, you know? Can you see how it's gonna melt into my skin? Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> I love it. The cap size is a good cap size. It is definitely big head friendly. And I love the hairline. I mean, even without using makeup to blend, because it's got these fine baby hairs, can you see how if you just pull them just very gently, now I haven't used any glue or anything like that, can you see how you can just use the baby hairs to create that finished effect and because they've got that such fine knotting it looks so natural make sure you don't cut them off <laughs> as I sometimes do by accident when you're cutting the lace but can you see I really want you to be able to see the colors in this wig I wonder like oh yes look Look how that brush is just gliding through the hair. I always recommend though, that when you're brushing it, you use water to preserve the fibers. Can you see the colors? Oh, it's a beautiful color blend. This is the FFT Caramel Blonde. Wow. You see how that very natural pre-prepped hairline gives it a natural finish. Ooh. The other thing I notice as well is if you want lift, this has lift. Then watch this. Now this is without using mega heat on it. Can you see how flat it's going? So the lift is in the fibers, not in the volume, because this density is like a medium density wig, which is why Caucasian people can wear it too. <laughs> Don't you love it? Yeah! This is all the hair forwards. It's a fair length, but not too long on the side. No idea what the back looks like because I've just been messing with it. Now, the way in which the layers are cut in this wig means that it works as a center part. Obviously you've got your 13 by four, you can wear it on the side, whichever side it is that you actually prefer. And if I want to flatten it, these fibers are really, really responsive. Let me see. Just... And I can get it to be a bit flatter. Now this wig, it has a good finish at the back, which means that you should be able to pull it up 
as well. Let's see if I can. Get the contrast in the colours. That layered look gives you that wonderful feathered ponytail which is absolutely gorgeous. Now you saw that I have not put any glue on there. This is a completely glueless install and literally I have thrown it up there. I mean that's an elastic band for crying out loud. I wouldn't normally do this. Normally I would probably just slick my hair underneath to give me as smooth a finish as possible and also probably just here at the edges but all I wanted to show you that this wig is done well so much so that you can throw it up into a ponytail and not worry about what it's going to look like from the back. I absolutely love this wig. I really do. Really, 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 really love it. Can you tell? Zuri's Prime Collection is one of the best human hair blend collections out there. I do you remember Lace Biz, how much that blew up the internet when it came out? Tell me what you think. Do you like this little number? Will you be getting shiny? I hope that you do. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I look forward to seeing you on my next wig review.